The next feature I want to talk to you about is dictations. I can use it in my universal search, so I can do the control space to enable that uh, search bar and enable the dictation, and then I can just talk to it, and then it will find something for me. So for example, look, my hands are up. I'm just going to hit control space, bring my hands up, and just talk to, to it. So I'm going to go to control space, profit and loss detail. And there it is. It did the search for me right here. So it found profit and loss detail. I didn't type that, okay? Let's, let me show you one more thing. I'm going to do the same thing, and then I'm going to say the word go after it. You're going to see what happens. So I'm going to hit control space, profit and loss detail go. And notice what happens is that go command at the end basically says, hey, if you know the name of the specific place you want to go to, just say it, say the word go, and QuickBooks will take you straight to it. Now, you're going to have to memorize, obviously, where all the other things you could access. So, for example, let's say something with the word uh, vendor. Let's see what's, what's out there with the word vendor. Um, so, we have vendor balance summary. Let's try that. So, I'm going to X out of that, do control space, vendor balance summary, go. And there you go. So I recognized my voice. It went straight into that report. It is really, really cool. So um, this is one of our attempts to increase accessibility around QuickBooks Online, maybe for folks that can only use one hand or, um, or, 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 or believe that talking to QuickBooks um, could be faster than typing things. That, that could really, really help. But there's one more area of dictation worth mentioning, which is... Um, I'm going to go into invoice for a second just so you can see. I'm going to go into invoice. And then let's say I'm typing up an invoice and there's a big part of the description that's just going to take a long time to, to dictate, to dictate, I mean to um, to type. So you can just dictate into it. So for example, I'm going to pick an item here. And then here's this description. I'm going to hit Control Shift A and then just talk to QuickBooks so I can type stuff for me. Repair downstairs bathroom, broken door, replace all knobs. Okay. So basically, I just talked to QuickBooks and it it um it typed that stuff for me. So that actually works everywhere, actually. So if I want to search for a customer via dictation, let's say I want to find um, this customer called Brian Shu. So I'm just going to delete here the customer. Hit Control Shift A, Brian Shu. Okay, close. <laughs> we're we're getting there. Okay, but I could just I could have just typed that Brian. So for example, let's try that again. So Control Shift A, Brian. Okay, so I type Brian in there, and then if I only happen to have one Brian, there we go. So any field, drop down, memo, description, otherwise, you can dictate with that Control Shift A option. Okay, so that's